Jack, thank you for joining us. It's a disappointing one for us today, having gone ahead and then ultimately not picking up any points. Yeah, very disappointing. Um, you know, we back ourselves to if we go ahead, like that's part of our our game. Now we stay strong and we stay compact and we don't concede. Um, but you know, that's the difference. And like in our situation, we can't we can't be conceding too after going ahead. And with the last two games and how we've played and the expectations we're now putting on ourselves, like we're expecting a clean sheet and a win now. For you, it was the fourth assist of the season, which is quietly creeping up after the past few games. It's a nice ball inside to, to Dwayne. How is it for you? you? You obviously started out wide and then came into midfield. Is, is that being able to, to be um, I think on your feet and change position? Is that something that's part of your game? Yeah, I think um, I think it comes quite naturally. Obviously, I, like, I think it comes with just watching football and as I grow and play more games like you learn different positions but I feel like that is one of one trait that I have I can I can fill in when needed to in, in other positions and I, I can switch my mentality to, and my game understanding to the position I'm in and help out the team as much as I can. Is there anywhere in particular that you feel most comfortable? Yeah I think as like a, as a number eight, maybe a centre midfielder, box to box, I can get up and down the pitch, um, good energy, and then can also get forward and create. Um, but you know, wherever wherever the gaffer plays me, I'm I'm ready and I feel comfortable, and I'm, I'm just there to to help the team as much as possible. The fact that we're we're talking and we're disappointed over the fact that we've not picked so many points about Luton shows that we've we've come quite far in in the past few weeks, doesn't it? We've you know a month or so maybe we would have been disappointed or, or taken some positives over the fact that we gave them. A game but today we were you know annoyed at ourselves for not finishing the job yeah I think that's um a big like part of our growth right now like um over the last few few weeks and over the Christmas period we've definitely um like our mentality switched to we we're going into games three points every week don't care who the opposition is we expect ourselves to get three points with the quality we have and um you know we're disappointed when we don't and um I think my, and even if we got a draw, I think we'd still be disappointed that we've not. We've well, we would be. We would be disappointed we've not kept on, kept a clean sheet. Um, but you know, um, stuff happens in football, and um, you know we just got to bounce back from this. For you as well, like we touched on earlier, that that final product seems to be coming into your game. You, you had a slow start to the season where, you know, that that goal is still eluding you, but the the assists are coming. Is that something that you're building on, trying to make sure that your involvement in the final third is is leading to opportunities? Yeah, you know, it's something that me, the gaffer, like Kenny and Narcisse, like we sit down and we talk about uh, how I can get into um, the positions or be more effective when I get into those positions. And um, I still think there's loads of improvement for me to do. I can still obviously get the goals and um, like be better even like more and get more assists and in, in the same games. But, you know... Um, Another assist today, and hopefully I can just keep bringing um, goals and assists to the team now soon. Jack, thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much.